They were doing what thousands of Torontonians do every single day, ordering delivery to their homes. Now they say their bank accounts were depleted. Pizza Pizza customers say they have become the victims of alleged fraud and their debit cards were swapped and stolen while they were making payments. A simple transaction turned into a nightmare. Not only is it tra tragic, it's beyond surprising. Such things shouldn't occur anywhere. It's just, uh, there's no words to really, I uh, know to really describe it really. I mean, it's scary because like, it's not only that about losing your money, it's like your personal information. City News was contacted by multiple Pizza Pizza customers in the same week with identical stories about how their bank accounts were drained. Thousands of dollars taken just hours after they ordered Pizza Pizza to their homes. That's how shocked and surprised I am that you could actually order a pizza in the city, have your card swiped, but not only have your card swiped, have your bank account depleted. The stories start out the same way. A man arrives at the door, delivers pizza in a box without a hot pack or delivery bag. But that's where the red flags end. Everything else about the transaction seemed normal. The customers both paid with debit and were given receipts. But at some point while they were paying, their debit cards were allegedly swapped with ones that looked identical to their own. So I came to my wallet and took out the card and I selected this is not my card. I pulled my card out and, and I started to punch the numbers in. But I noticed that the first set of numbers were off by one digit. So, you, you know, immediately I recognized that it wasn't my card. It wasn't until they were notified through their banks that they realized their accounts had been compromised. They cleared your accounts of everything less $9. <laughs> They took all the money. Everything that was in my account except $9. I was quite angered, you know. So I was like, oh, okay. You know, so what do I do now? Because yeah, <laughs> yeah. I was never been in this situation. Course, yeah. So I said, like, so uh, I was first I was thinking, like, am I gonna get my money back? <laughs> right now, I have basically negative um, uh, eight hundred ninety-nine dollar. That's what the guy told me. In a statement, Pizza Pizza tells us the safety and security of our customers is of the utmost importance. We have processes and protocols in place to ensure this does not happen. We are currently investigating to understand more and will be taking the appropriate action. More than just money, the customers are wondering if their personal information has been compromised and how the delivery men could have possibly known their orders and addresses. I'm figuring it's either an inside job or somebody from like I did an online order so either somebody saw that I just want an answer yeah. from Pizza Pizza and, and make people aware mm -hmm. I mean that's the most important thing because you're, you're talking about personal information that if you if you can lose all your personal information just for, from ordering a pizza yeah. what about other stuff that we do day and day right the customers ordered from two different Pizza Pizza locations, one at Young and Center and one at Queen and Broadview. We did reach out to police about the incident, but they say there are no open investigations into this as of yet. However, the customers were told that officers would be in touch with them in the next 48 hours.